Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video and in today's video, I am going to fix the problem you can see uh, in the screen. The problem is you don't have license to play this game, error code 561. And in this video, I am going to fix this problem and I'm going to tell you something. Listen carefully. After get the license, don't spend your money and don't use your original account because this is this way is that is not the official way to play this game. So if you don't understand then go back and listen carefully okay so first of all what should you do actually if you want to play um apex legends mobile if you get the license uh from apex legends mobile so what should you do for this so here you can see i installed bluestack emulator you you 100 you need bluestack emulator so install it in your pc so here you can see i have the bluestack emulator bluestack 5 install it in my pc and after bluestack installed you you will get two actually two things first one is bluestack 5 and second one one is bluestack multi instance okay so you have to open bluestack multi instance after open the bluestack multi instance you have to press on instance over here and you have to press on fresh instance and you have to go inside the nogat 32 bit you have to press on it you will get here is a um, version called pi 64 bit beta you have to press on it and you have to press on next and you have to choose your RAM memory and uh, you have to choose your uh, CPU actually. After that, you have to choose your resolution, what, re which resolution you want to use. I'm going to use 1920-180. You have to press on download. So here you can see the download will be started. So after download, we're coming back. I'm going to show you what should you do. So here you can see it's done. It's already created and uh, we, we have a Pi 64 bit. What should you do now? You have to press on start and here you can see it's it started it's p64 bit beta so here here you can see on top i think um you guys are understand how to get a 64 bit pi 64 bit pi version of blue stack emulator so it's it started already it will take a little time for starting so here you can see it's already started and what should you do now you have to log in with your uh, play store here you can see I'm, i i log in with my uh, play store already and uh, uh, and after that, what should you do? You have to um, you have to uh, connect with your uh, VPN already. If you have VPN installed in your PC, you have to connect with your VPN and you have to connect with Singapore or which server you want to play. You have to connect with server. And after that, I'm going to show you uh, here. It's Apex Legends, A-P-E-X, Apex Legends here. So here you can see it's called me. I have to pre-register myself. If I do pre-register, then it will take um, one year, two months for I uh, accept my pre-registration. So I don't need pre-registration. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to take pre-registration from here. So after that, what should you do? After login with your Play Store, what should you do? You have to open your browser here. I'm going to I'm going to search. I'm going to open my browser and you have to search in Google ES File Explorer. ES F-I-L-E Explorer. So here you can see. I'm gonna go inside the first thing. Uh, I'm not gonna go inside the first thing because I don't know uh, what it link. You have to go inside the second link over here. ES file explorer. You have to press on latest version and I have to download this one. It's downloading. It will it will start download and you have to press OK. Here you can see it's download started and it will take little time for download. So here you can see the download complete. I'm going to install this one right now. Uh, you have to go inside setting and you have to give permission. You have to go back and you have to install this one es file explorer it's installing you have to press on done you have to close it so after doing this process what should you do you have to uh, download this folder here you can see it's a folder error code 561 error 561 actually so you will get the link in the description download this one after download this you have to uh, copy this and or you have to go inside the folder and you have to copy um, this two file from here and you have to copy it. I'm going to copy this one. And after that, you have to go inside the, this PC, go inside C drive and you have to press on view and you have to check hidden items. If I if I uncheck this, there are too many of folder is gone. And you have, if I check this, I got too many uh, extra folder over here. And after that, you will find a folder. If, if you check this um, button, you will find a folder called program and data. You have to go inside program data. After that, you have to go inside Bluestack and XT. After that, you have to go inside engine. After that, you have to open um, user data. After that, you have to go inside the share folder. After that, you have to paste it here. So here you can see it's pasting. So here you can see it's pasting complete paste uh, already. It, it's, it's done. It's done. After that, you have to close this folder. You have to open ES File Explorer in your Bluestack. After that, press on Agree, Allow, 
and you have to go inside internal storage and here is a small slash button here you have to press on slash after that uh, there is a folder called mnt here you can see it's a folder mnt you have to go inside there you have to go inside windows folder after that you have to go inside the uh, here you can see the share folder bsd share folder you have to open it and you will find that obb folder and apk okay and after that what should you do you have to press you have to just press and hold on it i'm sorry you have to press and hold on it after that you have to press on copy after that you have to go inside um here you can see it's a home button over here you have to press it and you have to go inside internal storage android and you have to paste it over here okay it's here you can see it's uh, pasting actually um it will take a little time to paste so here you can see it's done so now what should you do you have to install this apk you have to go inside settings and you have to give permission and i'm gonna move it because here is a notification so you have to press on install right now it's installing installation complete you have to press on done after that close the notification the notification is not going to be closed okay it's uh, always pop up in front of me i don't know why so you have to press on backs back over here back you have to just actually you have to remove this you don't need it and here you can see it's a uh, your apex legends mobile over here you just press on it and you have to wait and watch what's going on actually here you can see the verifying download it's connecting with your play store automatically you have to press on allow allow again the game will be started so i'm gonna uh, mute it the game will be started here you can see there is no permission required there is nothing there is completely nothing just the game will be started here is here you can see it's going to be download receiving info version information and everything is going to be open so actually this is the way to fix this problem i think uh, you guys are understand everything if this video is help if you like this video and if this video is uh, help you to give permission give you license to play this game then let me know in the comment section do subscribe to our channel stay home stay safe bye bye take care